and my best friend. And I don't know how you did it, because when you needed to be my mom, you were my mom. And when you were my best friend, you're my best friend. And I'm so happy that you're here celebrating with me today. So yeah. thank you so much. <laughs> 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 um, fantastic. Um, I'm an old bride. I'm 30, so you guys have been with me a time or two, a couple years and all the <laughs> like that.
Because of my last name. Like, let's just be real. That's why we started talking. <laughs> <laughs> All right, because we went to separate schools. We were little girl poms together. And she always had the biggest crush on my cousin. And then all of a sudden, names match up, and I think she thought that maybe it might be her in, in like the second place. <laughs> <laughs> in the best of ways, she ended up being like an amazing person. She didn't need my last name or my two sons. That was always super into her, and they're just a match made in heaven. But outside of that, we have little girl moms right? together. I think we were in that until they kicked us out and said, guys, it's not cool anymore. We have to like, figure it out. So then we did that too. We had so much fun in high school between all of our trips we took together and things. Um, I spent a lot of time at your mom and dad's house in high school. And I remember being there for one of our many slumber parties in your basement. So like seriously, I think we lived there at Lane Shores for years. But anyway, somehow we got talking about names and things like that. And I'm not the best with this. I never saw Gone with the Wind. I never read the blog. Shame on me. But I remember <laughs> Cherry saying that that was kind of where Tara's name came from, that that plantation there is Tara. And what is Tara? Tara's home. So in the movie and the book, they're all like, oh, we got to get back to Tara. We got to get back to Tara. Because Tara's home. And that's the best way I can describe Tara. Like, she's home. She's my heart. She's my soul sister. She's just somebody that she just gets you. And there's just no better way to describe you. And I'm happy to have you as my friend from little on and officially family. Mm -hmm. Thank you for right. being here. <laughs> Honor, this is my brother Jacob. <laughs> as you can see, he's a character. He's a hoot and tons of fun. I know I'm the older sibling and you're supposed to look up to me, learn from me, all the things, but I think you taught me much more about life, about what it means to be a good person, a good human being. You have always been such a huge support to me. Um, I've had it really, really lucky. I've grown up with an amazing father and a wonderful brother and incredible men in my life. So partially why I'm a 30-year-old bride is I have high standards to say <laughs> Somebody who fits in with Dad and Jake, it's just, it's amazing. He's hes always got my back. He's probably the only person who can truly criticize me, and I take it for what it's worth and not get mad at, because I'm like, I just trust him. <laughs> so I'm really grateful to have you by my side. We love you. Thank you for this wonderful shower hosting us today. My family not here today, um, including my godmother. I have cousins and cousin laws who aren't here today. Um, unfortunately, we oh. are losing my uncle Joe to cancer, so they are with him right where they should be right now. But if anybody can just send prayers, positive thoughts, vibes, strength their way, really appreciate that. But I just wanted to also acknowledge her herself. So thank you all so much for being here.
I like all my things. <laughs>